Greetings and salutations. I'm Kev. Welcome back to this Let's Play of EU4 at the Golden Horde. I mean, uh, our trek into India is a bit of a detour, I admit. It is definitely a detour. You're gonna go to Sweden, aren't you? Yes, you're, of course you're gonna go to Sweden. Don't go to Sweden. Who cares about what Sweden thinks of us? I want to, like, butter up Fars and Sistan. Because at some point we'll have to integrate them. Yeah, 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 bloody nobles. Their days are numbered, though. Are you sitting on a fort? Is that why this is taking so long? No, it's not a fort. You're just marching through back and forth. That's okay, then. Anyways, you guys unseat this mess. Have we gotten that final bit of ocean? No. And... Reconquest on Kokomis. Really? You lost provinces down there? Huh. And the Ottomans have secured land over there. I didn't even notice them take that. Oh boy. Mirwari separatists, that's... Uh, further up country. Yeah, these are gonna fire first. Let's get the Bamani separatists first, and we can deal with the other ones later. You're gonna move up here. Don't have a leader. Let's fix that. Gerbsk. One day, so you can actually move. There we go. Our absolutism is still pretty much flawed, which is unfortunate, but it's gonna be fine. Gordon Country is gonna be over in a couple of years, and then we can definitely go places. Uh, supports of the Great Salt. Ooh. Gain manpower, legitimacy, or prestige. Um, what I'm curious about this one. Which of these choices are better for the Gordon Country event chain? Because this one doesn't give you... Uh, an instant uh, notification of which one's better. I mean, all the other ones are basically crush the rebels and gain autonomy, gain uh, uh, strength through the crown. But here, I mean. Would be wouldn't be bad to get those things, but they're gonna get their legitimacy anyway, and prestige is fine. You know what? We'll take the manpower and not uh, save the money. And there, finally, are the separatists. Let's go and kill them. Uh, okay, that's the Battle of Boron Boronshne. Uh, just you know, split up. And take these two. It's fine. Few rebel control provinces than one. Okay. This was fired in June of 57. So, June of 67, we can end this mess. All we have to do is smash rebels. Shouldn't be too many of them left. There we go. That's dead. Next one is going to be Mewari Separatists. They are should be in Northern India somewhere. Ajmer, Kittor, and somewhere up here. Yeah, these two. So, go there and here. And just by stationing you, the, stationing you there, you should be able to beat that one down. Uh, 
All the gain autonomy here is kind of annoying, but... What can you do? And that's all the claims on China. Right. This area is going to be less revoltish now. Even the crappy general actually succeeded here. Oh, you've been on That's what's going on. You've been on sieging my territories. Oh. Thank you, Fars. Kind of you. Okay, Dash is going to be added to a trade company. I think. Dash, there you are. Excellent. Um, I think we're going to keep going with the Hindi ones. As long as they're cheap as, like, 20, that's fine. Even the toughest one can actually be done now. Let's go and uh, get those under control, too. That's with, this is without a, sing, uh, a single missionary. Or a uh, inquisitor. Anyways, I wanted to check on combat width. I haven't checked that in a while. Has that increased? 34. So 34 divided by 2 is pretty much what I want to aim for. So 17. Which is pretty much what we have. Could even use more cannon at this point. But not yet. I want to keep building up the country first. In most places, that isn't really gonna do much. Let's see. Oh boy, yeah, we have quite a few workshops that need to be built. Uh, the killer general is gonna go down here, I think. Deal with that. Yeah, you have a new leadership by the looks of things. Yep. And he is administrator and he wants not that much actually. Still granting Eth Ethiopia though, which makes that expansion a bit difficult. Uh, you're allowed to Kaffa, so I'd have to know CB Kaffa. Which isn't ideal. Um, oh boy. Here cometh the Separatists. You know what, you need to stay around here. Uh, Venad, where is that again? It's down here somewhere. Yes. Turn back, turn back now. I might even want to send my fleet over there. Speaking of fleet, it's time to rebuild that uh, merchant fleet too. months just to make some money. Some monies. Build cost does not, does not extend to ship costs, unfortunately. There we go. I was wondering when they were gonna fire. Okay, go down and kill those. Not you. Not you. You. There we go. Uh, we want to move towards legalism. How many wars do I have to fight to kill Ming? Holy shite. Okay, we need to get started on Ming fairly soon, otherwise we'll never have time. Though I suppose we could try to force a Ming uh, implosion. By fully occupying them and just waiting for the rebels to fire, and yeah. Which is probably what they're gonna have to do. Probably. But I need to secure Gujarat and get the India under control so we have all the monies in the world first. And I would very much like to get rid of the Timurids. 
Anyways, now that England is at peace, I don't really... Well, actually, no, they're not at peace. But they're not really fighting that war. I have to wait for the next war. They're gonna fight another war, we know they are. Holland holds Calais. Okay. That's unexpected. Uh, did they actually do anything? Cancel the missionary, I assume. We didn't actually convert that one. Okay, never mind. Murata Separatists. Those are the bastards that created all tons of new cores up here earlier. Grrr. Evil bastards. Okay, never mind, there are more of these events. Corals and Nobles of Zaporozhia. Uh, yes. Are they rising up in Borisogelbsk? No. But everywhere else. That's fine. Go, smash. Hulk smash. It said White Karelia. That's not White Karelia at all. That's Kiev. Kiev without a fort. Ugh. Oh well. That's gonna hurt. Anyways, the other ones here we can we can probably squish this one fairly this one, these ones fairly quickly. That one's done. You're gonna move north. Wait one day. Move. More worried about the Marathi ones, which are probably going to fire around here, so... Good invite a scholar. Do I want the extra merchant? You know what, at this point? Sure. Because I need to... Um, steal more money. Steal more monies. I just don't know where. All of this money is going to flow our way anyways. Uh, but sure, I'm going to park him here. Regardless. I don't think there's anywhere where I can actually make money with a merchant. Well, I could try to collect in Kazan, I suppose. That would be kind of hilarious. But I think it's time to consider pushing out there and securing the Baltic. Anyways, we're gonna have a couple of rebellions for this, and then we're gonna come out of this She's smelling of roses. Hopefully. Oh, I didn't put the, didn't I put the battle guy here? I didn't put the battle guy there. Oh. That's bad of me. Did we finish coring the provinces? We did. So at least that's not gonna be an issue anymore. No overextension, no nothing. South Konkan converted. And trade companies. Okay, I need Mr. Battle Guy in here. Otherwise, we'll lose too many troops. Right, I moved him down there. I completely forgot. There we go. Komi has become self-sustaining. Fantastic. Uh, you're gonna go here. 
start extending our grasp onto the steps here before Japan takes it all. Okay, that one's under our control again. Excellent, same as Azo. Go here. Lithuania is in a bit of a pickle here. Zaporozhia. Good. Go there, please. Thank you. Uh, no, let's... Well, boo. Okay, that's problematic. At least those. Actually, we're gonna go with the rest. There we go. More production. It's gonna be more monies anyways. The only valid rival is gonna be the Ottomans, so we're not gonna have any rivals. I don't care. Need to dramatically increase our economy. If we're gonna afford all the fun things we want to do. Am I not the separatists? Okay, he's gonna die. That's two and a half years done. But anyway, since those events are repeatable, I don't think I want to start any new, new, any new wars. I think that would be uh, kind of risky. Hot chocolate. Good for you. Hey, Defender of the Shia Faith. Thank you, Babanis. That's going to be interesting. More army tradition is where it's at. I don't really care about naval tradition at all. Yeah, right. We were supposed to build those ships up. I completely forgot that too. There we go. Ten ships. And you can protect trade around Indus. Then I need to start protecting trade here as well, right? Yeah, the Ottomans aren't stealing that much down here. The problem is Kiev. So I need to, like, murder, murder Poland. <laughs> and get control of the Baltics. So much money is flowing east. So, yeah. I think we need to start beating on Lithuania and friends. At any rate, since uh, Sweden is still our puppet, what do they give us? 11 diplomatic points a year. Well, it's not nothing. I'm just very surprised that we kept those. I mean, it doesn't make sense. It really doesn't make sense to keep those when you essentially lose all rivals. Yeah, I know I'm losing claims east and left and right. That's just how it's gonna be. Um, you're gonna go up here. Now I can almost tear down those temples, like, temples again, if I want to build something new there. Uh. Probably need to start building some of those menu factories too. get our income up and running. Of course, right now we are suffering a 20% malice on the base tax. <laughs> That's kind of cool. So if she's a, tw <laughs> a much higher chance. Does this null each other out? Do these null each other out or not? I wonder. Anyways, he died. Um, now we need money. 
Uh, do we have enough force limit for that thing? Okay, so we don't need that guy anymore. So now we're earning four of these. Very nice, and we're definitely going to get Absolutism as well. Because we need to end Court and Country Disaster with more than six, 50... Is it 60 or 50? Probably should check that breakpoint up. Don't really care about propagating religion. Uh, I'm gonna go with land maintenance. Save more money while we're building up all these things. I can't cancel these policies until the uh, Court and Country thing runs its course anyway. Uh, that won't matter. Won't matter. Sort of matters, but it's still middle points I can use for other things. Uh, in Mogadishu. Can't have that. Yeah, not gonna rival the Ottomans. Not yet. Soon, though, once, I'm n once I know that Bamanis and Ming are crushed. And that I can actually, you know, stand up to the Ottomans. Then! Then, maybe. But there's absolutely no point in doing that for a very, very long time. Because we only need a single province from them. It's gonna be the last province we ever conquer, I think. How they all dis decide to die at the same time, huh? Um... I can't promote you, but that's okay. Convert things faster for me, would you, sir? Still Mogadishu, right? Yes. Oh, that's the kind of pop-up I hate. Popped up, I was about to click this one away. Uh, anyways, Venad first, before I forget. Venad, add to company. Uh, colonial expansion. Yeah, sure. Expand the borders. Oh, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to take a loan. No, no, no. Because this resets at the end of the month, and we should gain that money. I don't know, what counts first? Does it check for this loan or not? Did we take a loan? We didn't take a loan. Okay, so it uh, gets the balance first and then it checks for loans. Good. Refusal to pay taxes, how dare they? Oh, let's pause the damn thing too. Um, League of Mogadishu, let's crush it. Smash. Oh, they took the province, all oh, these clever bastards. Where is Kipchak? That sounds like something on the steps. And it is, somewhere damn far in on the steps. Ugh. Anyways, go in that way. We'll deal with that. In due time. Die, rebels. Uh, which one was that fired? Where'd you come from? I didn't even see you. Damn it. Uh, fine, you can go down and kill that. Yeah, we want to arrest the real leaders, but I would like to have this army a bit closer. And ideally led by this battle guy. It's only 12, though. Yeah, it's gonna be fine. 
We just have to survive until... <laughs> Nobody's gonna declare war on us, I think, so... I'd be very surprised. When was the last time we were declared war upon? And why did you... Black flag. Wait a second, are you telling me that... I thought you could never cancel military access if you did this, but apparently you can. Huh. Okay. Well then, I can't really do anything about Can't really do anything about that then. Or I am misreading those numbers. Somehow. Anyways, we no longer have the access, unfortunately. Still keep check, still keep check. And you're still miles and miles and miles away. And you're absolutely crap plastics, but that's okay. Let's just fire it up. Just so the event doesn't shift and cause a whole bunch of troubles. Yeah, our claims are going away because... Because... Not actually fighting for them. Gotta keep making them though. Oh! France declared war on Malacca. Oh dear me. Well, that could be bad for you, Malacca. Could be very bad indeed. Why are you transferring the trade here? Seriously, why the hell are you moving the trade there? 66, let's see how big of a swing that made. Yikes, that was a huge swing. Why the hell would you transfer the trade over here? Oh, because you're trying to move it there and then south to here. That's what you're trying to do. Which makes sense, I suppose. Anyways, conversion of Gaur, which can be trade accompanied. Here we go. And let's get rid of a few more Hindis. Uh, or, do, or should I go? Should probably go at the other end now. Then you have all the stacked modifiers. Yeah. Anyways, it is time for a break. We'll keep building up our infrastructure. I think it's time to start building some manufactories. There should be a couple of them that are very valuable. 67, look at that. 77. Yeah, these are rather nice. Rather nice indeed. But that's for another time. It is time for a break. Thank you for watching.